is invisible. is 2020 and Keanu Reeves did its cyberpunk stuff but uh, which uh and this young Chinese boy decided to contract a disease called uh, JDM -tism. basically it's a boy or a girl um, liking JDM cars to an obscene amount this is usually caused by initial day a um, couple of you know Tokyo drifts or FNAF <laughs> At the same time, there's also a catalyst called the uh, Best Bordering Girl. If you don't know what that channel is, it's a. Uh... It's pretty cool. Amongst the videos this channel has, um, the thing which enthralled me most is the Civic vs Subaru video. Not the 86 vs MRS and all that stuff. But no. It's this video. Not because of the Civic or Subaru, it's because of this car in the back. Like, right there. This is the new 2018 Toyota Mark X. What the f? <laughs> <laughs> What's this car? Well, it's absolutely faster car than the Type R in this video. You can see here, it's absolutely destroying it. Even though, you know, the Type R is a great all that stuff. Yep. Yeah. This car has 220 horsepower, a V6, and all drive, making it like a Subaru, but reliable because it's a Toyota. You see, this is my cannon point because after this, I became absolutely enamored by luxury sedans which has performance while also being comfy. Skip two years and now the emotionally traumatized Dioxide watches Cyberpunk Edge Runners, which is a uh, and this man right here decided, hey, you know what, um, I'm gonna buy a car, you know, it's been a couple of years staying in a new place, you know, it's time to get a car. Of course, like a maniac who decided that, hey, I would like a car and I have a limited amount of money, I did not go to dealerships, I went to a Facebook marketplace. The absolute worst place to actually find a new car because, Jesus Christ, man, holy shit, what the, f what, what, what the f is this place? What the f So after like, let's say, one or two months of trying to search a car, I found one. Um, it's kind of far from my place, to be honest. Today! Uh, today! Not tomorrow! Not tomorrow. Today! Uh, 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 uh. Today! Uh. Welcome to Calgary, a city in Canada well known for a uh, stampede. There's not a lot of cities in Canada and if there is, there's not a lot of things to do usually. So why the hell am I here? Well, because this is where my friend lives, Mr. Garage from Funky Garage. He makes cool anime shit. Look guys, I need you guys to know something, right? I need a car which is um, dependable, reliable, because this is, again, my very first car. Anyways, I bought a slam car. When I was purchasing the car, there's a, there's a slight issue in which that I did not read properly. Um, the car does not come with wheels. So... Are the word S1Rs. <laughs> I sort of a sheep. It came with a couple of curves, but not a lot of them. It's still a pretty good deal at uh, 2,000 bucks. And also cracked two times. Um, yeah, that happened. I was like 50, 
I would love to just roll around in that. Yeah. You're the cool uncle. Now hold on for a second, I will explain as to why I bought this Lexus looking thing. Firstly, the car is uh, modified well. Yes, it's minus 7 degrees in camber, but it has BC Racing coilovers and, you know, kind of expensive camber arms. It's not a Lexus, it's not an LS400, it's better. This thing is a JZX, ouch, ow my a JZX110, well, well not really. Introducing the S170 Crown. If you watch Noriart's video, you might have seen these boats before. Don't do that. Don't do that. But mine is a sedan instead of the estate. And that might actually be a good thing because in the video, Noriaro definitely said, Honestly, if you're gonna buy a Crown, you just get a regular sedan because that would feel better to drive. As it's a JZX110, it's also powered by a 1JC single turbo. Meaning that, according to the internet, this is a four-door Supra. It also has a Toyota Supra automatic transmission. So, uh... One of the best part about this car is definitely the interior for how weirdly modern it is. Like, did you know that this car is a 2002, but is equipped with a touchscreen sat-nav that has predefined suggestion routes and trips in Japan, including restrooms, restaurants, and camping sites? I know, right? I know what you're thinking now. Whoa, this YouTuber gets a new car. What will he do with the car? Is he, you know, I'm um, gonna like freaking put all oh, the oh, 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 Realistically, uh, no, none of them. The car's a daily driver. That's that's it. The car's a daily driver. It literally is. It is my daily driver. I. That's the only car which I have. But while well, we have the car, no pretty slam and looking good, we can just go to a... Uh